Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews. And today I've got another episode of Search for Snacks. I could actually call this what's for breakfast because it technically would be breakfast, but uh, it's not really like a full-fledged breakfast. Found these in my grocery store and uh, I thought I'd give them a try. <laughs> I, I'm kind of like a big kid and I like some of the you know the things that are uh, meant for kids but the grown-ups like it too I found this in there this is from Ego and it is called um, uh, Wafflers chocolate chip banana Egos and it's got the minions on it they're the minions and I'm sure most people probably know what a minion is they've got the movies from Despicable Me, this is new, and there's well, there's a puzzle on the back, you can cut it out, and it says ask an adult for help, I guess you move the pieces around, and for this, for two waffles is four waffle bars, is 230 calories, and all the other stuff, they've got a whole lot of list in here. You can check it all out. And I don't know all the names of the minions. I remember the one was Kevin and one was... Uh, I don't remember the other one. Kevin and... Uh, uh, I don't know. But yeah, one with the one eye was one. And then they had uh, different names. And <laughs> they always seem to have different people in there. And so, yeah. Like, they were always talking about banana. Banana. So, anyway. So this is, and let's see if I could. Sometimes they have a tab on it, but no zip tab this time. And it says in here just to put it in the toaster for lowest setting for a few minutes or put it in the oven. And so what I'm going to do is just... I open this up and take one of them out. I could always kind of smell the banana already. Wow. <laughs> kind of big in packs here. Kind of that's how it comes. <laughs> so they got like uh, different packs. So I'm going to go ahead and just open up the bag and take out two. And I can already smell the banana. Kind of chocolatey chip flavor and i'm gonna go ahead and put yeah i'll go ahead and get two of them two of them and put them in there and i'll be right back put these in the toaster for about a minute or two on the low cycle and just to heat them up because they are frozen so be right back okay i'm back i toasted them in the toaster which is actually right behind me went ahead and put them on here you can see they've got a little bit they did get a little bit brown, and I put some butter on them, and I'll see how that works. And I'm also going to try them with a little bit of maple syrup that I got. And we'll see how these taste. I'm going to try these just on their own after they've been in the toaster, and they got a little crispy. And they're not, like, super duper crispy. If you like them crispy, I guess you can, like leave them in there like through two toasting cycles is what it said but i kind of like mine so they're not real real toasty and uh so i'm gonna give this a try oh here we go a little chewy but that's what the the eggo waffles are they're already pre-cooked they're not real crunchy i can taste a little bit of banana like banana nut bread can't taste a lot of the chocolate on that, but here we're gonna go again. Hmm. Hmm. Pretty good. They're nice and chewy. They do have a good amount of banana flavor to them. Not very much chocolate chip in there, at least in the piece that I'm getting. You can probably put chocolate sauce on it. You can probably put powdered sugar you can put syrup you can put you know, whatever 
you like. Mm. Okay, so did that. I got a little bit of real maple syrup. Not the fake stuff like you get in the Mrs. Butterworth or one of those. I'm just gonna in the nooks and nooks and crannies here. Looks like it fell through a little hole. So there you go. Got a little bit of syrup on it. And it's dripping everywhere. So here we go. With the syrup on it. Mmm. It's pretty good with the maple syrup. Gives it a little bit of sweet. Hmm. Oh yeah, now I'm getting a little more flavor with that butter and the banana and all that. It's actually pretty good. Hmm. Yeah, it's not bad. And I bought this and I think it was like three dollars for this box. Maybe you can catch them on sale. But yeah, I'm actually tasting a little bit of a little bit more of chocolate chips and a little bit of banana flavor. So if you want like a little quick snack at night or in the daytime or I don't know if your kids like waffles and you want to you know get them up in the morning in the breakfast and pop it in the toaster and say you know here you go before you go off to school get yourself a minion <laughs> have a minion and uh yeah so and it's 230 calories 320 sodium so it's not terrible again if you want you can make your own you know waffle mix from uh and if you got a waffle iron and make your own i guess you could put bananas and uh, chocolate chips in them and give them a try so go ahead and give you guys a rating for the wafflers chocolate chocolate chip banana minion <laughs> waffles i guess is what i'm gonna call it give those seven out of eleven they're pretty decent Nice little quick snack for those of you that want a little little breakfast treat or a late night, you know, little uh, thing. And it's not terribly sweet and it is pretty good. So I'd recommend picking one of them up and give it a try. So if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit the subscribe and notification bell right over here. That way you won't miss any future content or when I go live. Also, you can feel free to look through my playlist in my library Lots of different items out there, lots of different reviews, and you can check those out at your leisure. So, till next time on Drew's Food Reviews, when I'll be trying some other unique item out there for you, even something that's despicable me and the minions. And, you know, those guys are pretty cool. <laughs> so, anyway, till next time on Drew's Food Reviews, I'll talk to you later, and I'm going to finish off these last two little waffles because <laughs> they are pretty good so till next time talk to you later